Hi everyone and welcome to this YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to talk about how to become YouTube millionaire so before starting this video. And subscribe to our channel future updates. That was the first question that entered my mind when it was recently reported that YouTube's most lucrative channel in the UK did not feature a pop superstar, a legendary rock band or the biggest TV show around. To be fair, I am hardly the target audience. Laura Edwards, co-founder of Viral Talent, the channel's agent, points to its success in engaging preschool viewers with cheerful, colorful content. Launching channel while setting up a YouTube channel is free and easy, producing golden content is another matter. It has never been more accessible but it has also never been more competitive, said Amy Fairbank, director of Manchester-based video production company Lizardfish TV. Her clients include the BBC, Vogue magazine and Madame Tussauds. Standards are getting better all the time. It takes much more creativity, much more engaging content to really stand out from the crowd these days. And nobody wants to watch shaky, badly shot content with poor audio, she said. Till, I can save by shopping around for low-cost accessories. And Ms. Fairbank reckons there are some excellent, free editing options for beginners, such as iMovie and Lightworks. The main investment required is time. I can learn basic filming and editing techniques on, where else? YouTube, but there are no shortcuts. Ms. Fairbank said, you will need to vlog on an almost daily basis to build a following, and even then it could take years to reap the rewards. It takes dedication to create constant video content with no immediate benefit. The business model. I could be waiting some time for the money to roll in. To novices like me, YouTube's advertising system is incredibly complex and opaque. Fundamentally, the more popular you are, the more advertisers are prepared to pay. But you need to clock up 4,000 hours of viewing time for your videos in a year and have at least 1,000 subscribers to qualify for the Google Partner Program, which provides a share of ad revenue. Under this program, vloggers can select a common option in which they get a share of advertising revenue ranging from 5p to £7 for every 1,000 monetized views, that is after YouTube takes 45%. Only 40% to 60% of overall views are deemed worthy of advertising spending, based on various factors such as the location of the viewers and their level of ad engagement, that is, how much they skip or click on ads. YouTube also recently changed its rules so that creators are only paid if viewers watch their videos for more than 30 seconds. The other option is cost per click advertising, where they are paid each time viewers click on ads surrounding the video. A YouTube spokesperson said the site offered resources designed to help channel creators, such as the YouTube Creator Academy and analytical tools. YouTube is an open platform that enables creative opportunities and a distribution platform for original content creators and advertisers large and small. Making an impact. Competition on YouTube is brutal, with more than 500 hours of video uploaded every minute. Most of the experts who spoke to the Financial Times agreed that one or two videos a week was the bare minimum now required for success. Dan Middleton, a British gaming star who earned £25 million last year, recently admitted working 12-hour days to post daily videos and stay ahead of the algorithm, which was recently tweaked to reward busier creators. Just missing a day can drastically reduce your views, subscribers and overall revenue. Small wonder that influencer burnout is on the rise. Last year saw a flurry of confessional videos from full-time YouTube stars charting their mental health problems. Many have taken digital detoxes to recover, some have retired from YouTube altogether. One vlogger with about 80,000 subscribers, who wished to remain anonymous, told me, my most popular videos get six-figure views but the maximum I earn is a few hundred pounds. When I think about all the research, time, skills and promotion I put into each video, I wonder just how sustainable it can be. Persons of influence. But YouTube advertising is not the only game in town. Creators increasingly make extra cash from influencer marketing. This ranges from affiliate links, where influencers earn a fee every time viewers click on a product link, right up to highly sophisticated brand collaborations. The anonymous vlogger said he typically earns a four-figure fee for such partnerships. One video he produced in conjunction with a streaming service was a moving, heartfelt and deeply personal monologue about mental health. I had to remind myself it was promoting a TV drama, particularly because the partnership was far from obvious, 
flagged by way of a subtle link to the program in the drop-down description. Successful vloggers, and the agents managing their careers, can be cagey about the sums earned from influencer marketing. However, prying some numbers from leading agencies. 1. Google Partner Program. Any creator can get paid a share of ad revenue through an AdSense account, so long as their account is advertiser-friendly, so no nudity, violence or copyright infringements. You choose what kind of advertising you would like, such as skippable videos, and how you would like to be paid, by cost per minus 1,000 page impressions or by cost per click advertising. 2. Google Sponsored Program. This option is only to channels with 100,000 subscribers. Here, fans pay a fixed monthly subscription to their favorite creators for exclusive perks such as badges, downloads, live chats or meet and greets. 3. Google Preferred Program. This gives advertisers access to the most popular 5% of channels, which get premium rates in return. But this elite club is fiendishly difficult to crack. 4. YouTube Premium. Premium subscribers cough up a monthly fee to forego the ads and access exclusive content. Here, creators are paid based on how much viewing time they notch up. Tours need to tick a paid promotion box before they publish anything that advertises a third-party service and label the commercial relationship clearly and accurately. The ASA has detailed guidance on its website about most commercial scenarios that vloggers will encounter and how to deal with them. Over-promoting brands now has very negative connotations, said Mr. Hugo. Audiences are more aware today that YouTubers have to fund their way to creating more great content that stays free. But creators tread a fine line between this and selling out. It is a problem that many smaller, cash-strapped creators would like to have. Instead, they rely on more humble affiliate marketing. The biggest scheme out there is run by Amazon, with commissions ranging from 5% to 15%. This explains why YouTube is stuffed with videos recommending Amazon products, though other schemes are available, such as a Win, Shopify, and Thanks for watching.